Now, I want to thank you two for coming down here today to the New Orleans Chamber of Commerce. Thanks for inviting us, Mr. Williams. Sure, sure. Now, I have some really great news that I know small business owners like yourselves will really appreciate, and I have a special guest here to deliver it. Oh, where's the Saints? <laughs> Go marching in. <laughs> I love that song. Welcome to New Orleans, Mr. President. Hey, my pleasure. Glad to be here. Hey, of course I'm going to be here on Fat Tuesday. When else would be a great time to visit New Orleans? And I love everything about Mardi Gras. I love the king cakes. I love the hurricane drinks. You know, I love uh, the beads. Hey, you know, in uh, Washington, we always drink uh, Stoli Dolis. I would. It's a Stoli vodka with pineapple juice. Uh -huh. It's like uh, John Boehner. You know, it's white and brothy, and if you're not careful, it's going to fuck you up. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, what's the great news that you have for us? Well, as you know, I'm all about the small business owner. And I do know that small businesses need help in these hard times we have. Oh, yeah, we sure do. I mean, with the rules of corporate tax rates, I can't afford to hire any new employees. Mm -hmm. Well, that's why we're going to cut taxes, the tax rate, from 35% to 28%. Wow. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's great news, Mr. President. <laughs> great news. And uh, now, in the Mardi Gras tradition, somebody needs to flash me. <laughs> uh, excuse me? Well, you know, I mean, it is Mardi Gras. Usually the tradition is somebody throws you beads, you got to flash them. You know, I just, I just threw you a gift. <laughs> Kind of like beads. <laughs> I'm not sure that that applies to this. Oh, come on. I am okay with it. <laughs> really? Yeah! Yeah! That's what I'm talking yeah! about. Yeah. All right. Yeah, there you go, buddy. All right. All right. Beads for you. <laughs> yeah. You like it? Yeah. Uh, okay, well, cutting the tax rate is the start, but we need more than that. Yeah, she's right. I mean, big, big corporations are still going to outsource their jobs to foreign countries and get those same tax breaks. All right, how about this? How about this? What we'll do is we'll cut tax breaks for big corporations that send jobs overseas. Now, that will force them to hire ready and willing Americans. Definitely. Yes, that is great. Yeah, that is great. Thank you. Yes. Thank you. Yeah. I just threw you a gift. Uh, let me let me guess, like beats. Yeah, like beats. <laughs> Come on, show me the good stuff. Well, if that's what you require. Yeah, that's what I require. Yeah. yeah. Oh, come on, give me a little shuffle, shuffle in there. Come on. Yeah. Okay, all right. You get one little one. Okay. Next time, put your heart into it. Uh, Mr. President. We're all super grateful. Mm. I was wondering if there's anything that um, <clears throat> I can do to show my gratitude. <laughs> well, yeah, I'd like to taste your king cake. Oh, Mr. President! No, that's not a euphemism. I just, I actually would like some king cake. You know, Michelle won't let me eat cake at the White House. <laughs> so if you could bake me a king cake, that'd be awesome. Oh, oh, sure. Um, but you know, if I bake you a king cake, that's kind of like beads. <laughs> It's a gift. <laughs> oh, it's Showing like, you a gift. Okay, it's like that, huh? It's like that. Show uh, me what you got. Oh, okay. Show him, show him, show him, show him. 